Hi guys, today is uh, June 22nd, uh, 2022, and I wanted to show how low bowling hurts the business. So I have here JB Hunts, and I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna act like if I'm gonna do, I'm gonna place a, uh, an offer for this load right here. It's going from from Bloomsburg, Philadelphia, to Salt Lake City, Utah. It tells you how many miles. 2014 and the weight and what you're actually carrying plastic sheets it's for a dry ban right now the cheaper offer 4200 and you can place an order or place an offer sorry and then for example if you put 5000 it tells you that you're you're charging $2.48 a mile if you do 5500 you're charging two dollars seventy three a mile. Six thousand five hundred. You're charging three dollars twenty three cents a mile. Uh, you know the same. So let's just look at the load. It tells you from where it's going to where it's going, and it also very important. It will tell you someone already put an offer on it for six thousand dollars right there that's the counter offer and then if we click place an order place an offer I keep saying order I want french fries and then let's just say you know we're trying to lowball like we already know that somebody put six thousand so right here I'm like oh I'm gonna go for five thousand eight hundred that's two point eighty eight a mile which nowadays is really good uh, <laughs> but with the increase of uh, diesel prices Anything is everything is changing. So let's just say that my truck and my trailers are paid off, and I am, uh, you know, I am. I don't really have that, you know, I don't have that. I don't have that much maintenance. So I decided that I could take this load for five thousand, and it will make sense for me. So therefore, I, if I put that five thousand, every other offer that comes after that one, they need to challenge my five thousand dollar for this trip so that's how my low balling hurts this load or hurt hurts the carriers that are trying to get paid you know the good amount of money because diesel is not going down and everything's expensive so the gentleman or whoever put the six thousand dollars for this load it's asking 2.98 a mile which is perfectly fine you know uh, that that's what it should be paying but uh, if I, if if I had a if I had a truck, I would probably go for five thousand eight hundred. Uh, you know, just to be able to compete with whoever already put the six thousand dollars for the load. But yeah, this is very straightforward. It tells you when the offer ends. Um. But yeah, don't don't lowball yourself. You know, if you know somebody already gave you exactly what they want, do your own math. You know, you basically know how much you need to make in order for your business to make sense. But at the same time, do not uh, go below what you are expected to get paid. If you if you lowball it, you're hurting everyone else, every other carrier that comes after you. That's about it.